I'd like to invite you to bring more comfort and ease into your neck and your whole body actually. And we'll do a very easy, simple lesson that you're going to lie down on your side and you're going to just need a pillow or cushion or blanket to support your neck. And once you lie down on your side, you pick your side, either side is fine, whichever side is more comfortable. And then once you are on your side and then you can just listen to my verbal guidance. You can close your eyes and then just really immerse into your sensory experience and just really connect with your body and then you can start to feel your body. It'll be very short. So go ahead and grab uh, support for your neck and lie down on your side, pick your side. Stack your legs up like so. I'm bending my knees and hips about 90, 90 degrees. And as far as my top arm, my right arm in this case, you can either rest, have it at the side of your body or in front of your body. Either way is fine. Okay, so once you are in the position, now you can close your eyes and then just listen to my verbal guidance. It'll be very short and simple. And please bring your attention and awareness to your top shoulder and then begin to move your top shoulder forward and back directions gently and just very, very slowly. It's not a stretching exercise, but you do move fairly, fairly slowly so that you can pay attention to your body, how your shoulder movement connects to your neck. So let your neck and head and your ribcage, your spine, they all begin to move and participate. And the shoulder moves and your hip, even the hip is beginning to move. Now, now you start to actually move from your hip. So move your pelvis forward and back, the top pelvis, at the top hip forward and back directions. Then as you move your hip forward and back directions, let go of your abs, let go of your uh, trunk, muscles so that you can allow your spine, ribcage, and the neck and the head all to participate and connect to each other. So through this movement, and please sense the connection between your neck and the hip through the spine and the ribcage. They are all connected. Improving and reducing the effort to your neck, the tension to your neck and the hips in the back is really about improving the connection and the relationship between one part and the rest of the body. So that is really about improving your relationship with your body. So when you are done several times and sensing the connection very clearly, then you may stop. All right, that's it. And so how was your experience and how did you feel? And do you feel increased uh, awareness of the body and more relaxation, reduced tension around your neck, around your back. And how are you feeling? You feel more connected to your body. So um, I don't know why, but uh, um, I think uh, I haven't really talked about my weekly Feldenkrais classes. And I think you're probably not aware that I'm teaching Feldenkrais classes online uh, on Zoom every week. And so, if you want to have a better connection and relationship with your body, yourself really, uh, then please check my uh, weekly Feldenkrais classes and I, I will put the link in the description and also in the comments so you can check that out. And um, it's really, really reasonable price and it's only $30 per month and with the $30, it gives you access to four live classes and you get to interact with me every week. And have questions and we can go over any questions that you may have. And also, and if you cannot attend the live classes, then you get, to, you get the access to the library of the past recordings, all the, uh, the audio recordings uh, up to this point. And I do have uh, about 125 Lessons, <laughs> that's a lot. Uh, so anyways, I hope uh, you enjoy this little lesson and uh, you want to experience even richer and deeper experience because the class is uh, 45 minutes in an hour. And so you really get to connect with your body and get to explore the movements and 
really cultivate the body-mind relationship connection. So please check the link in the description. And uh, if you have any questions in the comments, then please leave your comments and questions in the, in the section down below. So I hope to see you in the live Feldon classes every week. And uh, so if not, then well, I will still see you here on my channel. So see you next time. Bye-bye.